the start of the god, I told you I'd get you these 50 skill books nice and easy, and I plan to stay by my word. So the first place you want to go is to the Hunting Brew Meadery, which is southeast of Whiterun. And when you go inside, if you head all the way to the back and then up on top floor, you can find this room and you can get the book called A Game at Dinner. After you grab that book, we can head to Whiterun in Arcadia's Cauldron. And we're going to get the Herbalist Guide to Skyrim, which is just on the table in this room. After that, leave the shop and go to the Drunken Huntsman, which is back at the start of Whiterun. Now when you're inside, if you go behind the counter, now personally I hate when they put the book next to the NPCs behind the counter because if they're dummy thick, it's just very hard to be um, focused. Now for the next part, we can head to Jorvisker, and that's where we did the Companions quest line. And in the main hall here, there's actually a book called Halgard's Tale. Not sure why I pronounced it like that. Um, but right here at the very back on the desk is a book. Now we can get a few more books in this area. So if you head downstairs and go in the living quarters, we're going to get the marksmanship lesson, which is in Ayala's room. And if you head all the way down and then in this big opening, make a left and then left into the room, you're going to find her book in this case. Now you may have to lock pick the case but then you'll be able to grab the book. You also don't have to steal the books. You can just read them and that would be sufficient enough as well. So you don't have to take them, but you can if you want. And then head to this back room and get another book. And that'll be three books just in this building. Now after that, head back outside of this building and make your way to the left side if you're looking at the building and go up to where the forge is and there's actually a book next to the forge. After that, we're going to head to the Hall of the Dead, which is still in Whiterun. Now, once you're in the Whiterun catacombs, if you go left, you're going to find an iron door. Open it up, there'll be a skeleton you can just smash, and then there's going to be another book. Next, we're going to Carlotta's house in Whiterun as well, and she's got a book hidden in there for us. If you head upstairs, then through the doorway, on the side of her bed is actually a book laying on its spine. Next book is going to be in Dragon's Reach. You can see the Jarl sitting there, and then if you head down into the cellar area, you can find the Jarl's quarters. Now inside the quarters itself, if you make your way all the way up to this big staircase, you can then go straight through the doorway and then make a right and it's going to be on the desk. We're already on our 11th book and this one's also in white run. It's in the temple. And inside the temple, there's going to be an area that has a bookshelf and it's towards the back of the room over here. And you can see it hidden on the corner there called Withershins, and that'll be our 11th book. Now after that, we'll head to the General Goods Store in Whiterun, which is near the Arcadius Cauldron. And he's got the book on the shelf just sitting right here. After that, we can go to the House of Clan Battleborn and this is again still in white run. I have the locations in the top right if you do get lost. And it's just on this shelf here with the apple on top. Now we're going to be moving to a different city. This is in Solitude and this place is called Fletcher. And the book is actually just immediately to our left when you go inside the building. Next, right across from Fletcher is the blacksmith. When you go inside the blacksmith, there's going to be a door that you can go through head up the stairs and inside this bedroom it's going to be on this shelf that's very high up on the wall okay next we're going to the Bard's College which again is in solitude now immediately in the Bard's College just go up the stairs and then make a right and you're gonna see a lot of books right here but if we go in first person view you can see the book we're looking for is on the top shelf called the buying game 
And then next we're going still in solitude and we're going to the castle dower. Once you make your way inside, go right immediately. And then there's going to be a left. And on this table is going to be our book. You can head back out the way that you came in. And then you're going to see the emperor's tower, which is nearby of where we entered in initially. So head into the emperor's tower location. You'll see a throne and then a staircase to your right. If you make your way up towards the top and then in the very back area of the room, you'll find a table with a book on top. Next, we're going to the city of Dawnstar. Now you're going to go to the mortar and pestle shop. And again, it's just behind her. Make sure she doesn't clap on you with those dummy thick cheeks. Next up, we've got the white hall. You can make your way inside. Once inside, go left and up the stairs and you will see a table. And that is going to be where our 20th book is. Next, we're going to the Dawnstar Barracks. Make your way inside and you have to go down into this doorway as well where the jail is. And you can see we need to get inside the jail cell. There's a key actually sitting here on the table that you can just take. And then you can use that to open the gate. He ain't gonna do shit. And to the right is going to be the book wedged behind the pillar. Next we're gonna be going to the city of Winterhold and we're going to Kraldar's house. This place is nice and small so at least it's very easy to get through. If you need to, you can pick lock your way in. Now once you're inside, it's actually going to be inside this basket. It's very cleverly hidden. How'd that get in there? <laughs> All right, so after you grab that book, we'll head to Berna's Oddments. Make your way inside and up the stairs. And it's actually sitting on the desk or dresser in the very back of the room, the back left corner. Next, we're going to the Jarl's Longhouse. All right, guys, so once you go inside, it's just under the staircase through this doorway. And again, it's hidden inside a basket, and you can actually take the basket, so that way you can grab the book much easier. And then after that, we'll head to the Frozen Hearth, which is still in Winterhold. And when you're inside here, if you go all the way to this back area, and then downstairs, you're gonna be in the cellar. And when you're in the cellar, the book is hidden behind these boxes. And you kinda of just have to get the right angle and you can go first person if it helps, but you can see the book is hidden right there in the crack. All right, we're already halfway through this. We're gonna to go to Morthal at Fallion's house. So we're in a new city and it's just on the desk by his bed. After that, we can grab another one in the same house and it's just on his bookshelf and it's the very bottom book. So there's two easy books and then we'll head to the guardhouse which is also in Morthal. Make your way inside and you'll see a bunch of guards. You can just go towards the fireplace in the very back and it's behind the basket and the barrel. Next we'll go to the high moon hall And when you're in here, you go up the staircase to the right and then through the doorway and you can jump on the bed and it's actually the book on the top shelf. Next up, we're going to Jorgen and Lamy's house. This is our 30th book. Now the book's actually to the left and it's hidden behind the barrel. So if you jump on top of the barrel and again, you can go like first person for a better view if you need to and then there's the book on the floor. Now we're gonna go to Thoner's house. We're still in Morthal. And when you're inside his house, if you go left, you will find it on the very bottom shelf under a basket. We're then going to the Moor side Inn. Now once you get inside, there's a room to your left and then there's a table with a basket and the book is inside the basket. 
We'll go to the Thaumaturgist hut, which is still in Morthal. Make your way inside. And the book's actually on one of these bookshelves on the very top shelf next to the bear trophy. And then we'll go to Markarth, a new city. And we're going to the Understone Keep. Now, there's actually two books we can grab here. If you run all the way to the back like you're going towards the blacksmith area, there's actually a table here with a book on it. And then we can immediately turn around to our left and then go ahead and make your way down the hall, trying not to run into shit like I am. And then there's a throne room. So you keep going past the throne room and there's going to be this door. Now the door may be locked, you can just lock pick it and then you can make your way up this little stairs and next to the bed is going to be a book. After that we're still in Markarth and we're going to the treasury house. Now inside the treasury house you'll just make your way to the left. You'll find this um, urn or pot kind of thing on the side and there'll be a book on the ledge right next to it. After we grab that one, we'll head to the Temple of Dibella. And we're going to go all the way inside the Inner Sanctum. Make your way all the way down the steps. And eventually you'll see these bookshelves here. And it's going to be on the left bookshelf and towards the bottom right. So there's a fair bit of books there, and you're looking for The Sun's Dawn, which is the third book from the left, maybe fourth book from the left. Next, we're going to Nepo's house. Now, these people may attack you from the side quest earlier if you were following the guide. And when you make it into the bedroom, close to the bed on the ledge over here is going to be another book. After that, we're going into the guard tower in Markarth. Enter the guard tower, make your way all the way down the spiral staircase. And there's a few books we can get in here. We can grab the one on the desk over here by the beds. And then we can immediately turn around. Turn immediately around, and next to where Tom Hainbeek is sleeping, you will find your 40th book. After that, we're going to the Arnleaf and Sons Trading Company, still in Markarth. And behind the counter to the left on a box will be another book. Next, we're going to head to Falkreath, so a new city for some more books. And we're going to go to the Jarl's Longhouse. And what you want to do next is go under the stairs through this doorway and then open the display case. And you will find a book. Next, we're going to go to Grave Concoctions, which is still in Falkreath. Make your way inside, and on the right, if you move the baskets out of the way, you will see another book. The next area is going to be the Hall of the Dead. Once you're inside, make your way over to the right where the beds are, and it's actually under the left bed, towards the bottom of the bed. Then we'll be heading over to Lod's house. Make your way inside and towards the left downstairs. And at the very back of the room on a barrel is going to be another book. After that, we'll go to the Falkreath barracks. When you get inside, if you go to the left, there's going to be a staircase. Just head up there. And then the book is going to be on the chest to the right. And then we need to go to the jail, which is actually down below. So head back down the stairs, and then you'll find a staircase that goes down into the jail. Now, I do get my trophy here, but towards the left by these crates is going to be our 47th book. Um, I'm going to obviously still show you 50, just because I got my trophy a bit early. And we're going to Dead Man's Drink next, which is still in Falkreath. This is going to be our 48th book, and if you go behind the innkeeper... You'll then find it to the left of her, sitting on the shelf. 
Next, we're going to get our last two books, and they're in Riften. So it's going to be our final city for our last two books in case you need them. We're going to Mistvale Keep, and we're going to grab two books at the same time, which is always great. Now make your way to the very back, and then make a left, and then go up the stairs. Now up here is going to be the chambers, and when you're inside the chambers, if you go through the doorway directly north, and then go left on the nightstand is going to be our 49th book. You then want to make your way back down the way you came and exit the chamber to go back to the keep. And this time on the bottom of the steps, you want to go right and then you're going to go to the barracks. Now, once you're in the barracks, if you go up the stairs to your right and then all the way up, you'll make a left at the top floor and the book will be on this desk in the corner. That's going to be your 50th book, guys, so that is the Reader Trophy done and dusted.